So, two cup semi-finals. We have Wolves, we have Monaco. League games around it, including a bit of a derby kind of atmosphere against Leeds United. The team very healthy at the moment with the ratings shining brightly. And the title still is within reaching distance. Of course, we've got to try and better Liverpool on goal difference. If we get a win, though, we will go joint top with them. Starting with Crystal Palace. A game in which I'm going to play Fred and I'm going to play Rashford. They're the two changes I'm going to make. Quite a few Brazilians in this team and Spaniards. We've got to try and beat Vieira's men. I've got the X-Man in Zaha. Can we do it to go top? I think we might do. Rashford, Anthony and Marcos Asensio. Jean-Philippe Mateto with their goalers, yes. Wolverhampton, we're going to play them. Come on. All over, it's been a very successful month. A draw in the derby. We could have probably won, to be fair. And, of course, we lost to Ike's first time round. Didn't mean anything after beating them in the second leg. There is spoilers right there. So, if we can keep this form up for the month, it would be very, very good. Even Newcastle as well. We've got to win that one. The other semi-final is Spurs versus Bristol City. I'm hoping Bristol can do them. Might as well check the Europa League. You can see Braga Barca. Us Monaco. I think if we get past the French team, we know who we've got in the final. Congratulations, Braga. Can't wait to play Braga. As yes, we are top of the league. Get in there. Still joint. We can get that point. Oh, and I don't even know it. As Asensio does come in, he scored instead of Sancho. Kane's got to come in for Rashford. Anthony's a little bit tired. Uh, Pau Torres, I'll chuck in for this. And we'll go with David Raya and Malassia. It's the cup. A few more players step onto the bench, but that team is definitely strong enough to do it at Wembley Stadium. Can we get ourselves a trophy this season? I really, really hope so. Ah, Wembley Stadium. It's been way too long since we've been here. Good to be back. Come on, the FA Cup Finals on screen. I could almost reach out and grab it. Wolves' team is good. It's kind of like real life. I mean, Adrio Rabio, that's a... Decent signing. Saw that Endo was in there as well, as they do get the first run on, but Pau Torres will always easily deal with that. Straight into Christian Eriksen. Harold Kane. Go on, Harold, into Asensio. We'll get the passing going really quickly. Bruno. Ooh, good challenge. Casemiro straight into Bruno. Fernandez now onto Wan Bissaka. Terrible touch, but he manages to recover a little bit. We'll go through the middle. No, we won't. It's on to Guedes instead. Rafael Varane. Absolutely love you. Love you. It's now wan -Bissaka. He's got another chance. Can he make a better pass with this one? Floated it towards the back post. He'll win the header into Harry Kane. Falls to wan -Bissaka. Now Anthony! Woo! Pedro Neto's going to run at us. Rafael Varane dealing with it again. But still, we need to try and get this ball. Cunha's round us. It's into Guedes! It's a goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers! Incredible passing. Incredible. Curled it away from David Raya. Trouble in London. Now we've got to try and recover to try and get back here very soon for the finale. As Asensio. Oh, I can't even get the ball through to Anthony. As Guedes is through again. Rafael Varane's going to get on his back. It's not hit. Oh, just confusion all around this Man United team. It's shocking. Bruno's just going to try and switch this. Asensio's going to head on to himself. But I don't reckon we get anything before that whistle. Cross is just blocked. It's out to Malassia. Harry Kane can't keep the ball. And that will be half-time. No changes. The team that got us in this mess can try and get us out. We're just not showing enough attacking prowess. And they're just snapping us. Mateos Cunhar as we just bottled the free kick. Endo can't pass that forward though. It's into Anthony. He loves a shot from that range. Ooh, and it's hit an arm for a free kick. Has to be Christian Eriksen as well to take this. I'm going to go for the back of the wall and it's just hit the wall. Free kicks are terrible. Pedro Neto now on the ball and Casemiro's had it passed into him. Still, when Casemiro's not clearing the ball, you know you're in trouble with Neto weaving and turning into Mateus Cunha and it's Kept us in the game, that save from Raya. We love our Davids in the goal as Trufier's got to run on though. That's into Guedes, another catch. Up to us to catch them out again, however, Casemiro. He's got to avoid the tackle. Referee, bring the card out. That's one of the worst challenges of the game so far. Endo, only a yellow. He's already made plenty before though, and Guedes... It's just Pau Torres straight across. Eriksen's going to put a ball out wide now into Daniel Mallon. 
That's back into Christian Eriksen, edge of the box. Casemiro is hit, Rashford! Lads, it's been terrible. Wolves are going to beat us here and progress to the final. If nothing changes, which I'm still hoping can, Daniel Mallon. He's took a heavy touch and it's going to be Cunha. It's going to be Varane to intercept and it's going to be Bruno to head it on. Mallon doesn't get there again. And the final whistle goes as it will be Wolves to face Tottenham or Bristol City. We've done it. We have bottled the world's, oh not the world's, but England's best domestic competition. <sighs> and it's going to be Wolves who just escaped on penalties. That hurts, does that one. Still recovery back in the Europa League. Yay. I'm not going to beat around the bush. I absolutely hate the Europa League as Rashford will come in. He's going to go on the wing, Kane and Anthony. Them three up top. Or do we put Sancho back in? I think I will go for Sancho and Anthony just over Mr. Rashford MBE. Oh, Malassi is actually higher rated than Shaw Berto now. Still, I do trust Shaw. Maybe a bit of English bias in there, but he's been here longer as well. First leg, always the highlights. Barca and Braga not playing yet. No insight to the elsewhere games. But a crossing opportunity for ourselves. Ericsson won't cross it. Instead, he'll give it into Jaden Sancho, still looking for the first goal of today. But it might go against us, as it's a penalty for Kevin Volland. Come on, David De Gea, I trust you against the German, but he's sent the wrong way. And the French team have the result so far. Early days, but we didn't recover against Wolves. A little bit longer in this competition, granted, as it's going to be Ericsson. To back heel that into Jaden Sancho. Kane peel off. There it is. Harry Kane with a finesse. Nubel. Nubel with the stop. As he's got to be offside. He has to be offside. Briel and Bolo one on one. David De Gea with the save. And Martinez didn't even clear it. Still a chance for us. It's going to be Jaden Sancho just to take this down. Oh, good one touch football there. Keeping it off the ground into. Anthony who ruins it. And Bruno Fernandes now to whip in a free kick. Come on, Harry Kane's lurking. Harry Kane was there. Still, it doesn't land to him. Casemiro instead. That's on to Sancho. Surely an arm. And I've embarrassed myself there because I've just remembered that handballs aren't on. Still a highlight for ourselves. Casemiro into Fred. Around the corner. McTominay chip that over the top. Harry Kane gets there. I beg Harry. There we go. Off the post and in. Mr. Harold. A 1-1 draw in the first leg. We play the second. Hey. At least it's not the same as the Ajax first leg. Newcastle next, and I think they're high on points this season. Yeah, the seventh. They're seventh. There's a big gap between them and Everton as well. You can see maybe Anthony Gordon's had an impact. As us taking Harry Kane definitely had an impact on Spurs down in 10th. The league completely open as well. Arsenal are top. We've got two games on hand in them, and we've got a game on hand of Liverpool, who we joint with. This game quite important in the title race now. Oh, and it's a 1-1 draw. Harry Kane missed a penalty. Joe Linton not at the driver's seat. Rafael Varane and Martinez was suspended. And that draw has done us a favour, but not too many. Still level with Arsenal, the game in hand, and Liverpool one point behind us. Pretty sure Aston Villa were up there as well, but still, this is a very important game to get a final. Then we le got Leeds. We've got them all today. And Old Trafford, it's getting towards the night time. It's noonish. Hopefully it's winnable. Oh, well, it's definitely winnable. It's not just winnable. It must be won. All I'm trying to say is this game's very important. You can see the other leg. It's 4-1 to Barcelona. And that, there's an A next to Monaco. Oh, there was an A next to him. Does that mean they're winning on the away record? Or if they do win here, they'll win overall? I don't know. All I care about is that it's Barcelona in the final if we get there. Which we've got to try our best to make. It's into Harry Kane. Harry Kane will slip it behind into Anthony. He's just got an easy run there looking for Sancho. Not a bad move. That's a good flick now into Bruno. We've got Harry Kane up front. We've got Sancho on the other side. But Bruno might take this alone, you know. Bruno Fernandes! Just what we needed early days here at Old Trafford. Get in there. Ooh, but lads, be careful. You're on the concrete. I don't want any bad injuries. Class finish, my stew. I mean, he could have used Harry Kane or Sancho. Didn't even risk it. Left the keeper no chances here is Minamino. He's a good player, of course. Played for the rivals in Liverpool. Now into Briel Mbolo. Got to stop that cross coming in. It does come in. And Kevin Volland scores at the Stretford end for an instant reply. This is poor, you know. But it could turn into a classic. It's now 2-2 on aggregate. Bruno Fernandes could look for Sancho here. Lively start half an hour in. Jaden Sancho slows down. Will he accelerate? No, he'll just pass it into Bruno. Very far out, but he'll go for it. Sometimes you've just got to gamble it as now Anthony 
That's a ball into Sancho. That's a sweet turn. Harry Kane first time. A very good save as now Harry Kane again. Harry Kane stepping inside of players left, right and centre. wan Saka though, man. Got to pass the ball better. Bruno took out. He could be injured here, Bruno. It was a very bad tackle. Will it be a red? I'm hoping and praying. It's only a yellow though for Kamara. Come on, send him off, referee, just for the laugh as Varane scored previously and he wasn't far off. No decider. No decider for me. No decider in terms of momentum. It is completely down to chance, which isn't good with the teams on paper. Really should be beating Monaco. I don't get why we're in our own half. Casemiro's managed to get the ball into Ericsson to go down the line into Sancho. Come on, one of our first attacks in a while and it might fall to Kane who passes it back to Nubel. And Bruno's got a gap there, you know. That's into Christian Eriksen. And we're gonna take Eriksen off in a minute. He's just overstepped it a little bit, finds Anthony, falls back to Eriksen. Okay, this is our best chance. But it goes. That was close. And they're pushing players forward. They want the win, Monaco. They almost had it with a pass past Martinez. He's going to have to put everything into this game because he can't play the next league one. As Fred, we're out without his main man in the derby. But Harry Kane's his main man here, hopefully. Missed. Tap in for Harry. It's an easy goal. Harold, I should even say, may send us to the Europa League final. A big goal scored, you know, a number 20, Newbill. Been so good in, but he makes a mistake. And I'm going to gamble on this game not being over. They're trying to get past us with Diata. It's an easy block. Not long left. Scott McTominay is now a player that's come on as well for Bruno. Trying to sharpen the defence up. May all be for nothing. Diata round the corner. And Bolo and Kevin Volland. De Gea came out for it. And that's the full-time whistle to follow as well. We will be going to the Europa League final. It's not one of the trophies that I wanted to win. But a trophy is a trophy. And yes, I'd rather win the Prem or the Champions League than the Papa John's trophy. That's not what I mean. It shows Europe how good we are. As we've got to beat Barcelona to regain the trophy. And adds money to our collection. Leeds is the start of a tricky run. Four games to win the Premier League. I'm going to be highlighting these. Definitely started with Leeds United. Ellen Road awaits these men on screen right now. Rashford, Asensio, even Fred the Reds back in. Hoping to make not only Manchester red, but the entirety of English football. A skinhead Tyler Adams leading Leeds United out. I mean, class in goal. That already puts confidence in me. I'm hoping the confidence isn't fake because Wahi has a big chance here and Pau Torres shuffled in good time. Now a free kick to us. Does Bruno score this? Does Bruno score this? I'm going to try and hit this. Around the wall. Catch class and out. It doesn't. Fred will get another run on the Yorkshire chance. Blistering out. Asensio. Aim to Fred. Here he goes. Chip that over for Marcus Rashford. MB. Oh. Oh my. Ramona. What a goal it was. Just the Ramona shot. Flick with the heels. Brilliant. Worthy of his knighthood. Look at that. For skill. Brilliante is now Fernandez again with a free kick. It's getting there. Still not going in though. And Casemiro, he's going to be able to pass the ball over to Wambasaka. Back in the middle. Asensio. This is brilliant football. The Real Madrid ex players getting involved. Fred goes out wide into Rashford. Rashford to keep this. He's trying to beat Christiansen, the brute. He's got round him. Malassia, edge of the box. Bruno with a touch yeah. of the shot. Oh my days. Leeds United are terrible. Oh, the goalkeeper is. I, I don't think Leeds United are terrible. Just to put it out there, the goalkeeper Klassen is. A solid 2-0 winning our derby S game. The atmosphere not really living up to expectations at Ellen Road. I'll just take the points and move on. It's not been enough to win the league just yet. Three games remaining. It's gonna be tasty. And I'm safe to simulate this, I think. Oh, no, I'm not. No, I am not. Fulham have beaten us 2-0. Pal Torres. Harry Kane missing yet again another spot kick. João Paulinha and Otavio. Liga Nos proving our downfall. Of course, both of them players coming through that league. Now, Arsenal will be clear at the top. Liverpool jump above us on points. Game has done us in, but risking it for a biscuit. The Europa League final priority. We beat Brentford 2-0. Through Kane and Sancho. And guess what? That does put us top of the league. Arsenal still to play. Three goals better on goal difference. Insanity. Liverpool dropping points when you don't expect them to. Ulster Fulham. 
And of course, it's Wolves to end us out. Gonna be playable highlights because, of course, we could be lifting the trophy. I'm hoping so. And two players to come through the academy because they're wanting out. Zach Smith, the Canadian promoted, and I too Hammerlinen probably gets a loan next year. Just to keep them happy. Keep the squad happy overall. Arsenal did not win. That means if we can put a team together now to beat Wolverhampton Wanderers, Manchester United are Premier League champions. And of course, it's the team that beat us in the FA Cup semi-final. Don't do it again, Wolves. So sold out Old Trafford. They know what's coming. Hopefully we make it arrive. Right. It's Anthony Taylor in charge as the referee as well. Yeah, fraud. I don't know why I just shouted fraud. I don't really know what he's like. I've, I don't really rate referees. I wouldn't have actually gone in to play the game, which I don't mind. But I do mind that. We've conceded straight away to Raul Jimenez. No, it's Guedes. It's Guedes. Again. Quality strike, you know. Kept it up on the volley, but David De Gea. Fingertips should do better. Wake up and smell the coffee, lads. I mean, if the two other teams do lose, it would do us favours. Sancho, if he's onside, he put his head where it hurts. All for nothing as well, which is funny as Bruno. That's a brilliant ball into Anthony. Oh, what a save, Jose Sarr. Absolutely phenomenal. Now Bruno to go to the back post, though. Pau Torres into the danger zone. Lissandro Martinez hasn't got back into the squad after the suspension, and he's going to have to fight for that spot. And Pedro Neto finds Sarabia. Now that's fallen to Neto again. We can't go two goals down in the game as big as this. That'd be soul-destroying as Sarabia finds Rabiot. Day. Big fan of that as the header won, though, from Goncalo. Someone mark Goncalo Guedes. Seriously, I'm sick of it. I've had enough, Robbie. It's now into Wambasaka. On to Anthony. Can't chip it. He didn't even get the chance as Trufier. That's over the top of us. What did I just say? Someone Matt Goncalo Guedes. Nobody does. Title slipping away from us. Can't really go all out attack as well because we've got Barcelona next. Maybe a formation change. That's a lucky bounce for Harry Kane. He gets one back. Very, very lucky. Now we're going to the second half, fully motivated, behind Harold and the team. Coming out in the second half to a few boos as well. They've not expected this to come, but we don't know. But we've got to believe Casemiro. He's going to get the pass into Bruno Fernandes. Harry Kane's the man to do anything if it happens. A different team since he joined us. We've panicked through Saar into a bad kick. Still, it's a shame we're against such a class keeper. Casemiro now threw into Ericsson as well. Harry Kane... Uses Jaden Sancho. Sancho to cut inside. Finds Kane again. Harry to keep hold of it. He's got some good dribbling, you know, Anthony. And Sarabia with a chance here for Wolverhampton. That's an open net. Drilled across the net. De Gea jumps on it. See at the end of the game as Harry Kane. He's going to slip a ball through to Sancho if we win the game. They do have enough to care about it as Bruno's shot is saved. Still Sancho can't dribble through. Oh dear, Sarabia. He's straight round the corner. Mario Lamina. Just me who thinks that's a weird transfer. Guedes! Good save, David. Needed him to deliver that, Sarabia. Just make sure it doesn't go to Guedes. It's going to be a draw if we get anything from this game. Harry Kane passing it straight into the man in front of him. We're actually going to lose maybe though. And we've got to hope the other two do. Still a draw could be enough. And Anthony's through here. Anthony, that's a ball through onto Marcus Rashford. I'm not celebrating too much. Oh, Rashford is. Rashford's full on celebrating and pointing. Does Rashford know something we don't? Piles on. From all the players. Only time will tell. Only time will tell if them scenes are for something. We don't even get a chance to attack again. Cheers. But nothing really happening. I don't think it's confirmed. Or is it? Because the players are clapping. They don't seem disheartened. Have we won the Premier League? Players are in the huddle. Marcus Rashford's late goal's done it. We're gonna win the league with a draw to Wolves. <laughs> Premier League title is ours. Oh, I really didn't see it coming. It's going to be Bruno to lift it. Get in there. All the work that we've put through. I were expecting to just get to the Champions League places. But Bruno Fernandes lifts that trophy. Manchester United Champions of England. That'll give us some money for next season. Zach Smith, you'll be joining us. That's trophy number one of five. 
ticked off. Not saying I still don't want to win it again, as that's the table confirmed. We won the league with 76 points, which is kind of disgusting to me. That is very lucky. 10 draws, 6 defeats. <laughs> Look at Arsenal. Look at City, where they are winning the league. They've had to put it in. Liverpool's done it as well as the players that we really pushed are now tired for the Europa League final. I'll still make some changes. I'll go with this. I'm going to still play David Raya. I'm going to play Lissandro Martinez and Luke Shaw. Fred comes in and I'm dropping all together Ericsson. I mean, Scott McTominay on the bench is doing very well, but he's more defensive. Anthony, Sancho and Rashford over Harry Kane, but McTominay is really calling to me at the moment. I'm going to stick Scott McTominay. No, he's out of position. I really don't want to go with anyone out of position and Casemiro is not budging from the role. Al Torres and Asensio have experience against Man United playing last season, but at the Allianz Stadium, they will not start the game. We will go with that squad I just showed you. The home of Juventus we're at now for this Europa League final. Of course, was here with... One of the rebuilds that we just did. Speaking of them, I'm trying to cook up a big one. So if there's not another rebuild for a while, I do apologise. Barcelona winning 7-2. They tried to do the 8-2, but of course, they're the ones that lose by that score. I don't even want to see the team. I know Robert Lewandowski will be playing, and I know it will be difficult. Mason Mount in there. I mean, them playing Mason Mount does actually put some faith in me for some reason. Because I'm like... The Englishman can get into that team who wouldn't really get into ours. I don't mind it. Or maybe he could as Robert Lewandowski finds a ball into Ferran Torres. Ex-Manchester City man. Scores the first goal. That is horrendous. Ball straight through. Just blasts into the bottom bin. Had our job a lot harder now with the players we've especially put out as Rashford. He's just won us the league. Could he get us back level in the Europa League? He should have. A great save as we've avoided injuries this season. I haven't spoke out about that. As we should have scored with a header. Ooh. Yeah, it's interesting to th think about. What's happened there then? Mason Mount. Money Mason. Number 40 at Barcelona. It came off Martinez. Brazilian Anthony to get going as well now. We need uh, two goals. So if we could get one straight back, that'd be good. It's Rashford. Not falling to anyone. Bruno Fernandes. Stings to Stegen's gloves with a pop shot. I say I didn't really expect it to go anywhere near. It was decent. Now Fred uses Rashford. Goes for it. And a ball now onto Kyle Walker. They've signed him as well. He's taking all the England folk and... That's us 2-0 down at the break. And we call on the Calvary. We're going to put Harry Kane up front with Sancho and Rashford either side of him. Also, Scott McTominay in there. Frankie de Jong goes in the book. And I've just seen in the background Nicolas Otamendi. What is all that about McTominay? But to me, it just seems like everything we do to Stegen's in the way. The world's best keeper in this game. He's honestly unstoppable. However, Harry Kane's tackled Jules Kunde again. Mark andre give over Sancho now to give that into Harry Kane. It's over the top now into Luke Shaw. This is good football. McTominay doesn't drag it on. Otamendi doing the business. Defo watched the World Cup once Barcelona and thought, I'll have them players, even though we can't do it with financial fair players. Harry Kane has the ball again. That's into Bruno. He's skying it. Just chucking players forward. Sancho into Harry Kane. That's a ball into James Sancho. Otamendi in the way. Still, this is a lot closer. We sneak in there, but we can't do anything. And Usman Dembele is going to kill it off. Nope, saved by Raya, but nope. Robert Lewandowski. He's unstoppable. The pole scores a goal. He's even got another ball onto him, and he's even chipping David Wright. Right, this is getting embarrassing. I mean... It's embarrassing enough as it is. And I did stick some youngsters on just for a bit of experience in a big game. The Premier League win shows we're good enough in England, but that shows we're not good enough outside of it. But we can't let that drag a season down. Premier League champions, phenomenal for us. Haven't checked statistics, but top goal scorer is Harry Kane. I'm guessing that's over Tottenham and here. Still, he's been amazing for us. He's missed quite a few penalties. Bruno, brilliant as well. 23 goals. They've all been with us. Rashford on nine. Asensio and Sancho on seven. Anthony letting us down on six, but he made up for it in assists. And Harry Kane was actually top scorer overall. Skamaka in the sandwich of a Man United pairing. Bruno was third. We've got no one really on the assist sheet. I mean, Anthony's down there. Kane, Sancho. But Martinez, most red cards. See, that's a letdown being top of that stat. 
Lissandro. Guess I don't call him the butcherer for nothing, as we've got to do a player of the season. For me, there's only one player for it. He's lifted the Premier League today. It's going to be Bruno Fernandes. Absolutely phenomenal. Captain, leader, legend. A leader of men sums him up brilliantly. Bruno, Bruno, Bruno. Might have seen some of the lone players playing all right as well in that little screen there. But we are going to see how they do next season. They will return. We will return. We will win the Champions League. That is what I've got faith in. And that is the next step.